Okay, so to wrap up the video today, we're gonna to talk about a camera that not many people use and not many people need, but it's called a PTZ camera that stands for Pan Tilt Zoom. This is a motorized camera that mounts to a wall. They always mount to a wall. You can maybe mount them to a pole with a bracket or you could also pendant mount it straight down from a ceiling. What's great about this camera is it will spin 360 degrees It'll look up and down and then zoom in and out as well. These come in all sorts of sizes. This is one of the smallest ones that we offer. This has about 27 times optical zoom, which, uh, which is up to about 97 millimeter. That would allow you to read a license plate out to 100 feet. Remember, when you install a camera like this, not only do you need a video wire and a power wire, but you also need to run a pair for data. Now, Chris, looking at this unit here, is this an indoor unit or an outdoor unit, or can I use them either way? Uh, it can be used either way. Uh, most of the time you see it actually applied outside. Okay. Uh, it's, it's mainly for distance reasons. Outside you have your greater distances. It does go inside from time to time, depending on whether you need more detail in smaller areas, or you have, say for instance, a warehouse with a, with a lot of distance that you need to cover. Okay. Um, All right, I see here that we have a cable management bracket too. And I guess that comes into play like our bullet cameras before. Not only does it hide the wire, but it also protects the wire from vandals. Uh, makes it for a real easy installation. And as you can see here, we've got some extra connections. We've got the video, we've got the power, and like we just talked about, you got that extra pair for the data for you to actually send the signal to the camera and tell it to pan, tilt, or zoom. Thanks again for visiting DSC's camera installation video series. Please visit some of our other videos at our Interactive Learning Center. And while you're there, click on Chris's Corner for a weekly blog where I answer customer questions.